join us on a just back from Dorset after visiting uh, Del Boy and Penny Pit Stop. Um, the bikes after 400 something miles were a bit filthy, so I'm just doing me manly duties of cleaning them up. Jen's bike's next, but I thought I'd just do a quick little walk around of the, uh, the Bonneville. I've never done this, this is all new to me, so um, just thought you'd show people what I've bolted on. Um, just drying it off at the moment a little bit. There's the old exhaust wrap smoking like like, uh, like a good and wow. Um, but yep, here she is. So it's a 2010 Magwheel Bonnie. Um, I ain't really done much to it. I've just bolted some stuff on after the stuff I ripped off it and sold it really. But um, it's current incarnation. As you can see, you've got the uh, Thruxton gel seats, so it's soft on my posterior. Um, and I can stick a cowl on. Fender Eliminator on the back. Um, I hope you can hear me. The exhausts aren't too loud, but uh, it's all on a shitty camera phone. Little uh, Alfred's finest mini indicators. Hagon shocks. Uh, chain guard, which I took to with me angle grinder and chopped the, that down. Some little rear foot peg eliminators. Yeah, what else we got to show you? It's on the rear end. Obviously, the Norman High Toga is popping away at the moment. Um, the Free Spirits uh, caliper relocation bracket, just to keep the crap off it. Um, we'll move down more of the cosmetic stuff. Uh, stuck me rear sets on there, Sato rear sets. Bit of an expenditure. Um, oh, as were the wheels. Uh, obviously, it's not a mag wheel anymore. These are slightly larger. Um, I went up, I think it's a half inch at the front width and a quarter at the back, or it might be the other way around, I can't remember, I'm still a bit tired. Um, but these were made by Doug at the Devon Wheel Company, tubeless talon rims, um, powder coated black, because uh, I like black. And then, yeah, well, we're moving on a bit more, just uh, <laughs> the wrapped pipes steaming away. Um, air injection elimination, obviously. Eight ball choke. Cool. Um, inside here is a breathe filter um, and uh, the uh, uh, sorry the breathe air intake and an open filter. Um, ECU's been remapped as well to suit. Uh, coming around the front again, another shot of the front wheel. Nice little Evo Tech mud guard. I actually bought that after I sold the Triumph sum guard. Um, still had change left over and I get the uh, the rad uh, oil guard protector on there as well because uh, obviously I've chopped well didn't chop the mud guard down this is a fiberglass plank that I uh, resprayed and well chopped and resprayed um, eBay cheapo um, headlight brackets powder coated black LSL light Christmas Prezi thank you mum um, and dad um, at the moment I've got the um, Pro Taper Carmichael Bend 7 8 bars on. Because um, we had a long trawl down the Dorset, I wanted to. I, I have had the LSL clip ons for a while, and uh, the next video is going to be me reverting the bike back to seat hump and clip ons. Um, I just wanted to. I was toying with the idea of flat trackery looky kind of thing, you know, maybe going a whole hog. But um, I don't know. I can't decide. I didn't think my back was going to take it all the way down to Dorset, but. Um, who knows? Who knows? I don't know. I quite like these though, now. Oh, I don't know. Um, yeah, cheapo eBay Motrax mirrors. Um, posh Armitage shank toilet flush. Um, fuel cap. Um, oh yeah, ignition relocation. All the usual crap that people do to these, you know. Um, nothing really special. Um, but yeah, that, that's it really. That's, that's I mean, this is probably a shit video, but uh, apologies. I think that's pretty much everything I've messed around with on it. But uh, yeah, there she is. So uh, next time, probably clip ons. Oh, British Customs Predators coming along, more black. So um, yeah, I'll stick those on as soon as they arrive. Should be about another week, hopefully. And uh, there we go. Yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, if you didn't enjoy it, uh, buy your own bike and do your own video. See ya.